case you couldn't tell there, we are planing the boards. We've got uh, rough pine. I can buy pine. Man, this thing's hard on the neck. We can buy pine from the lumber yard uh, at a premium then. And it'll be all plain, nice, smooth, perfect. Uh, but you pay through the nose for it. I got this from uh, the sawmill here on the island locally. And it's a whole lot cheaper. It's just rough pine. So what we're doing, I only need one side good. I'll show you what we're working on here in a minute. Uh, but I only really need one side good. So we bought a planer here. And yeah, we're still going to save lots of money. But the, the price of this pine is so much cheaper that I can buy this planer. I'll have it for many years to come yet. And, uh, and we're still saving. We're still just paying a fraction of what we would at the lumber yard. Especially right now, the lumber prices have just gone sky high. So uh, we're busy putting our ceiling in here. We don't need it perfectly plain. We actually like a bit of a rustic look, but we do want it a lot smoother than what the boards came as. And it takes some of that weather staining off. And uh, yeah, we're just, we're finally getting at our ceilings here. The first step here is get the ceilings done. Once the ceiling's done, then I'm going to frame the interior walls. And uh, then we can start drywalling that and getting things ready to actually live up here, uh, which we're looking, looking forward to, definitely. So this is what we got going on. This is the pile that we've got planed here right now. There's one that was in the process of being stained. That one is stained. And we're going with a very light stain. I believe it's called a Puritan stain. So we've just stuck it on here. Now you still see a lot of the dark, but it actually looks really nice when in the sunlight. It's not showing up that well here. Maybe that's a better way of looking at it. Or I could turn it this way for you. But it uh it's coming out really really nice we're very happy with it so that's stained in urethane that will be the ceiling for the upstairs here uh anise is not totally sure if she's going to keep this color um all the way through or not this side here there's going to be our master bedroom plus two small rooms uh we will be doing that on this side and then the other side of the house is going to be other bedrooms we may end up doing something different with the ceiling there We'll see we'll get this side done first and see how we'd like it uh, but today when the lights were coming through the window here the sunlight was shining through it definitely looks very very attractive and uh yeah we really liked it so that's what we're working on right now we're gonna run all these boards through the shavings we're getting a massive pile of shavings here uh we have a um uh a bucket system here for our toilet in the house and uh, that's what we can use that sawdust in that sawdust can be used in there so it's not like it's wasteful we're just filling up bags full 
and we'll be setting those aside. So rather than buying in shavings uh, for our toilet system here, the bucket system, we'll have lots of our own. So that's a savings as well. I'm not sure what a bale of shavings costs, but it all adds up. Progress. Looking forward to seeing pine around these windows and having it all done. Hopefully in the next next little while, if we keep working hard at it, we'll get that done. Okay, should we get back at her?